Hey everybody, it's Wave Storm Tracking Team Meteorologist Ryan Hoke here with Hokey Weather Facts for the 22nd of February 2024. We are dealing with a severe weather chance about a week from this recording here and partially why we've been able to declare an alert day and why there is some confidence that somewhere in the eastern half of the nation here is going to have severe weather is partially because of machine learning and artificial intelligence. Yes, these technologies are already helping us as meteorologists and forecasters here. While they're not perfect, they're useful in forecasting severe weather, especially in the long range here. One particular product that we use here at WAVE is the Colorado State University machine learning program that they have that's able to look at some previous data, look at the forecast data, and kind of make an interpretation as to where severe weather is possible over the next eight days. Now, of course, this stuff isn't perfect, right? So it's only going to be as good as the weather data we give it and its knowledge of weather. Weather. And that's where humans come in. The Storm Prediction Center has issued a day seven outlook for our area, what's called a convective outlook or a severe weather outlook. And Louisville has only been in one of those day seven outlooks. So seven days in advance, hey, here's a possibility of severe weather. That has only happened twice since 2008 when these outlooks were more, most widespreadly used here. So this is rare territory. No, it's not a guarantee that we're getting severe weather or anything like that, but it does say to us we need to pay especially close attention to Wednesday of next week, because not only is the artificial intelligence and the weather data saying like, hey, there may be an issue here, but also human forecasters like us and the Storm Prediction Center are starting to sound the alarms on this. I'm Wave Storm Tracking Team Meteorologist Ryan Hope.